<sighs> I don't know how people can stand it. I honestly don't. I've been homeless for 12 hours and I've already cried way too many times that I can count. The worst part of this so far of being homeless was uh, going to a shelter and having the shelter tell me that they're going to hold on to my diabetic medication and they're going to regulate it and dole it out and give me when I, when I feel I need it and then at sunrise they're going to kick me out and I can come back at five. There were so many people hanging outside the shelter biding their time until five at five o'clock that I, I just couldn't know I had an instant panic attack panic attack and I was like nope forget it so I went down the street to my nephews hung out there for oh good four or five hours and uh, tried to uh, figure out a place for me to stay but all it, all the efforts uh, fell through so I uh, got into my storage locker and I got an indoor storage locker got in there got a coat and uh, I think I'm good for the night I'm just sitting on this uh, bench close to where I used to live to uh, relax for a bit I gotta take my shoes off put some cream on them my diabetic nerve pain cream and my uh, horse liniment and then I got an idea on where I can uh, where I can uh, lay down and sleep uh, undisturbed without being bothered or nudged or told or, or found by police. So I, uh, I hopefully my plan works out. I've got like three places in mind. If I have to during the night, I'll switch. You know, I'll alternate. So yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. Man, this is rough. This is a hell nobody should experience. This is a uh, hell that a lot of people with big, large YouTube channels, hell of a lot larger than Taganzo Media, will never experience. And here I am. And I'm not going to insult your fucking intelligence by telling you who to vote for and how you should save democracy. Oh no, save that shit for Sunday. <laughs>